With an English version? First song's gonna be in English. Um, it's a Swedish folk song okay. called, uh, well, Visa från Utanmyra, um, which means song from Utanmyra, but okay. I like to call it um, Only Once I Saw the Man. Oh. Um, and this song uh, has three verses, and each verse the singer is saying like she saw this amazing man and he smiled at her and he like came to take over her life and then he walked away and in the first verse it's like he saw my rose and smiled i'm like oh that's that's sweet and the second verse it's like oh he 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 touched my rose and smiled i'm like oh that's sweet and the third verse it says he broke my rose and smiled he broke my resistance and all of a sudden i was like we are not talking about a rose here <laughs> <laughs> this is like an old uh, medieval way of saying this guy like took her V card and so yeah these songs are <laughs> like a, uh, wait, should we like have a disclaimer after oh, this, this, for this yes, show? This, these old Scandinavian songs yeah. are like mm, you know which you would not think no. so yeah I, I ruined it I've yeah. taken the innocence out of them okay let's hear um, it okay <laughs> the man but my heart would always remember like the wind he blew on in tall and handsome sure he would conquer he looked at me and he smiled he saw my rose and smiled then he passed me right on by yes he passed me right on But my heart would always remember Like the sun he shone on me Came to change all my life forever He looked at me and he smiled He touched my rose and smiled Then he passed me right on by Yes, he passed me right on by such a performer. <laughs> Did you like my dramatic interpretation? I can't wait I can't for people to like, okay, I can't wait for people to see the video for one okay. because I love just like seeing your face, your expression uh, on it. But I think you. that really adds, doesn't that add, I mean, you would know that like you can like inform us, like being expressive, using your hands, your face, doesn't that like come out in the song? 
Yeah, I mean, I feel for me, it, it helps me make the song so much better. Yeah. Um, there, I, there's been a few performers that I've seen in my life who I've been like, they are like so invested and they're just moving in their bodies and I'm like, and that's so inspiring. And I was like, well, I don't have to hold back for any, why would I not, why would I hold back? Yeah. And so there's specific people I've been like, huh, I like what you're doing. And, and then it just being in the moment. It does, yeah. Um, feels really good. Do you feel like that? <laughs> It's easier right now to be in the moment because these songs are a little newer to you. Um, like, are there some songs that are kind of like you've done? Oh, yeah. Seventy times. Although I've done that one a lot. The yeah. cool thing about these songs is that no one knows them, and yeah. so I can just do them, and people if they're still pretty fresh for I think everyone. Yeah. But um, they're inside me now, which it yeah, helps me really uh, yeah. I think sell it. So, yeah. are are these songs? Um, have you played them anywhere? Yeah, um, well, one of them I haven't played anywhere, um, the last song, okay. so we'll hope that one goes well. Okay, so that's going to be our, our exclusive. Uh, yeah. <laughs> um, the others, I there's a cafe that I play at in North Hollywood okay. in my neighborhood, a really great place I love called Republic of Pie. Um, gosh, where else have I done them? I don't know. I'll have to ask my best friend. He lives in North Hollywood. Oh, he'll so, have yeah, a, yeah, I'll have to ask a great him if he place. that. Yeah. yeah. Uh, okay, well, can you hear the next song? Yeah. Okay, the next song, let me get a little sip of water. Okay, yeah. Um, so. Um, we'll get one for you. Louie's yeah, gonna yeah. run and get that You're for the you. Best. Yeah. Um, okay, so the next song, <laughs> I love this song. It's a lullaby. It's an Icelandic lullaby, and this one's gonna be in Icelandic. I haven't worked out how I'm gonna how to do this one in English yet, but it's called it's called Stop Crying Now, Kid. Like stop crying. Um, just just so we before so this is in Icelandic. Yeah. How do you do that? Good. How did you learn? <laughs> uh, yeah. I mean, how did this happen? <laughs> I, I went to Iceland a few years ago, and that was very inspiring. Um, I went to some concerts, and I hung out afterwards. And I, I, um, there was a singer, and I introduced myself, and I, <laughs> I told her like I'd love to work with her while I was there. And I think she was kind of like overwhelmed, like what is this girl from California like stalking me at my concert? She was like, okay, cool, thank you. And then I gave her my card or something. I asked for her number, and then I don't, I don't think she was gonna give me a coaching. Okay. But then that night I went out to a bar and she was sitting next to me. Those and she kind of had to give like, me a okay, coaching. Yeah. She was great though, and so <laughs> that really helped me having a native speaker work with me. A native speaker who was a professional singer yeah. who knew how to really help me. Um, I've also there's a woman in Santa Cruz actually who I met through a mutual friend um, who co gave me some coaching. And I, even though I've had this coaching, I'm not I'm not like great. <laughs> I'm sure that I still sound like a person with an American accent. Yeah. But I try really hard, and it's really fun for me to try to like sound like yeah a native speaker. And when really. you're singing, you have some latitude on your accent. True, don't you? you do yeah. actually. It's, it's coming yeah. from you. That's yeah. true. That that and also just like when you sing, you're holding onto vowels. Like you can't sing exactly how you speak in English, much less in another language. That's true, yeah. yeah. That, okay, so what is the name of this song? Okay, this song's called Haitu Rauta Ringa Now. Okay, I'm not going to repeat that. Yeah. <laughs> um, it means, um, you know, stop crying now. Um, and it's a lullaby, and what, before I, I loved the tune, I thought it was so cute, I, I heard it somewhere on an album, I think, an Icelandic mm -hmm. album, and I've, when I had someone help me translate it, <laughs> it's, it's, it's a, like a legend about a doctor from the Middle Ages who um, was a famous healer in Iceland, but there was also a, th a thing where he, he did have to amputate a little girl's toe. Oh. And so I guess this lullaby came out of parents being like, hushabye, stop crying now. If you don't stop crying, this doctor is gonna come and take your toe. And, but it's okay because for every toe he takes, I'll give you some gold. So each is verse it? goes through and it's like, don't cry. If Grimmer comes and takes your toes, I'll give you a gold one. And the next one is, I'll, I'll, if he takes a few of your toes, I'll give you some more gold. And the last verse is like, he's going to take all your toes. <laughs> but you'll have some gold. But you'll have some gold. Well, it's yeah, really it's funny. Good. It's like almost like tongue in cheek, like parents rocking their baby to sleep. A lot of lullabies just have that weird kind of, yeah. Darkness. Yeah, exactly. It's kind of like, yeah, you know, just like Disney movies and everything. It's like always a weird kind of darkness to it. Yeah, yeah because they're based on this kind of dark legend yeah, from, exactly. or, you know, folk tale. Yeah, I wonder why that's okay. so different from the past. Like now, like we would never tell a kid the doctor's going to come and take, take your toes. toes. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> but you get gold. Yeah. Okay, well, let's hear it. Okay. Yeah, it's got 
tag i þær alla þó grímur tag í þær alla You're listening to KSQD Santa Cruz 90.7 Hopefully you still have all of your toes. <laughs> <laughs> but I'll give you some gold. Yes, exactly. Get gold out. So, you know, with this economy, oh no, we're doing okay. The event Santa Cruz radio show on KSQD Santa Cruz 90.7. They gave us a little time to give drink of water and, and reset ourselves. So what is our next song? Yeah. Okay, the next song is called... <laughs> Jeg lagde mig så stille. I love that you have, you, you have this accent down. <laughs> Thank you. Is, is, is New York? Is she Icelandic? Icelandic. Yeah. yeah. This one is that's Norwegian. <laughs> okay. So this is one of the first songs that I I worked on, um, and it's Norwegian. I'm Nor of Norwegian heritage. Okay. Through my mom and a bunch of Minnesotans. Um, <laughs> you have that accent ever? <laughs> oh well, I you know I'm like. I don't want to try it. I don't, I don't try it right <laughs> we'll, we'll get you off the hook on that one. Yeah. <laughs> um, but yeah, the um, this song I, I knew it's a pretty well known tune in Norway, of course, um, not here so much. But I translated this one into English. It's another story song, um, and I think there's actually way more verses. Like it's one of those old kind of medieval ballads that could have like ten verses. Okay. But I just did three, and um, it's it's real sad. It's dark. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> okay, let's hear it. Oh yeah, okay. Um, and in English, I'm calling it uh, Never Will I Ever Love Another. And my, my English translations are actually really close to the Norwegian. So, you know, I, I did my best with that. <laughs> yeah. Last night, oh so sweetly, I lay me down to sleep. I knew of my love, I'd be dreaming. He sent me a message, tomorrow we would meet. And then all my sorrow would be ended. Never will I ever love another Never will I ever love another I went to the rooftop As we always used to do And looked to the village Below me, there gathered in mourning a crowd stood in the street. In black, there my love lay before me. Never will I ever love another. All 
that I knew And all I could feel was only my heart slowly breaking Never will I ever love another Yes. So <laughs> Thank you. So sad. Danielle Thank you Crook. very much. And Kevin, what's your last name, Kevin? Smet. Smet. Okay. Kevin oh. Smet. Oh my goodness. Thank you, goodness. Kevin. I cannot Beautiful. wait for you. You both said because we don't, you don't have headphones, you can't hear it. I can't wait. To like replay this for you, it just sounds so oh, beautiful. You. Listen so to much. it, <laughs> yeah. Oh my goodness! Again, we get these such cool like little private concerts, and it <laughs> makes my week. Oh my goodness! Um, that I really enjoyed that. Oh good, um, thank you. Okay, so yeah. we have one more song, and this is like the event Santa Cruz, you know, radio show exclusive. Yes, yeah, and yes. What's this one? This one's called. It was so. This was a beautiful, sweet song. Okay. Um, it's still in a minor key, but um, <laughs> <laughs> um, it's very, uh, it's a love song. It's, I know a, it's in Swedish and it's, uh, it's called Jag vet en daily rusa. And it is kind of well known in Sweden okay. as a folk song. It was done in the 60s by a famous singer. But here, I don't know, I don't know about California and this song. Like, uh, there's a good my chance most of us have not heard it. Ever, yeah. yes. <laughs> Um, so it's, it's about, it's a love song about uh, someone I know who's a, as lovely as a rose and, um, if I... anybody actually has heard it, call us. <laughs> no, what's our, it's, um, and let's a, be a, friends. <laughs> yeah, 831-900-5773. That's uh, 831-900-KSQD. <laughs> Let us know if you know the song after you've heard it. Yogvet and Daily Rusa. There's a famous pop singer named Robin, and she did an amazing version of it. Okay. So it's oh, very okay. inspiring. Oh, cool. um, she's currently like a big pop star, but she did this song. So it is kind of known. My version, though, is, is different than any, any others. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, so it's just a beautiful song. It ends saying goodbye, goodbye, my dear heart. Um, a thousand times good night. Great. Okay. Yeah. I can't wait to hear it. Mm. Let's do it. <laughs> Jag vet en del i rosa och vit som lilja blad När jag på henne tänker så ljus mitt hjärta glad So hövisk och så ljud Som solen vager skiner Är hund som purpur klar Men alltid vara klar Må de få komma samman Med hjärtens fröjd Och gammal så längta till vara
we've ever had. I, I just so love listening. Oh, hey, thank you so much. And you know what I can guarantee? You, it's my favorite performance of 2020. Yes, <laughs> we won. <laughs> but no, oh, oh my, my goodness, thank, thank you, you so much. Thank you. It's yeah. such a uh, pleasure to, to do these songs, to have um, an audience here of two, of three, a of three, forever. Yeah. Um, it's, it's such a, thank you, you yeah. know, really happy to do this. Great. Okay, so again, if